right, guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Heck Strange. We're at the 2018 SHOT Show. We're on the convention floor. It's day two. And uh, what I'm trying to do is find like really cool, interesting things. I've got my guru of everything cool and interesting, my friend Jesse James, he's here. And we're at the point six booth because Jesse says I need to upgrade my sock game. And I didn't, I, I didn't really, I never thought of that, Jesse, so why? So you think about the most important thing that's gonna happen at SHOT Show, you know? I don't know how many square feet of area you walk by and how much, you, how much you're doing. And most people walk by everything and then at the end of the show, everybody's feet's hurting, and feet are hurting, and then they uh, they walk by and they come see point six and they get some socks, and then the next year the first thing that happens is everybody shows up on Tuesday and they tell them how much they love their socks, and this is uh, Skip with point six, and he can tell you about the technology that's behind the socks. Well, the sock begins with the ingredients that go into it, right? Right. And and the basic component is merino wool, and merino wool is nature's temperature regulating fabric right and, and what makes merino wool it's a it's a, a breed of sheep that has a very very fine yeah, we yarn got some of it right yeah here. you can feel it so you guys I mean, can sample it i mean that's yeah. like uh spider silk <laughs> it feels like silk right yeah okay so yeah. it goes against everybody's idea of what wool feels like because right. you think but it's going to be itchy sure and, exactly yeah. and a lot of wool is itchy all right, right. but merino wool with a fine micron, which is the thickness of the yarn, right. that against your foot feels fabulous. It will never itch. Right? Okay. Now, what it really does is that mm. it, it takes the moisture from your body when you're working out, even when you're walking hard or anything like that, and dispenses with it before it ever becomes sweat. Okay. So it, its natural thermal regulating properties will attempt to keep your body at the at your normal temperature, 98.6, okay. which, so by the way, is where the... Winter. the it's, it's not just for winter. Uh, it's absolutely just as appropriate for summertime. These are everyday socks. Um, I work overseas. I was in Singapore for three months last year. I wore their socks in 106 degree weather. I take my boots off. They don't stink. One thing that people don't know about uh, wool is that it doesn't. The bacteria does not cling to it. So a wool sock you can wear for two or three days, four days. Pay attention, kids. <laughs> because your mom and dad aren't going to yell at you for wearing wool socks for three days, right? Yeah, it's um, naturally antibacterial. Oh, that's great. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah. Now, the, I think one of the coolest things about their product, and I can't stress enough how this is probably one of the most important booths that I see at all kinds of conventions, because these guys represent not only the tactical industry, not only the military, they represent hikers and skiers, and they custom make their socks through R&D and tailor them to the person that's actually wearing them. They have three different levels. They have a light, they have a medium, which is about what everybody's gonna wear, and then they have a heavy sock. And now you would think a heavy sock would be used for cold weather, but if you ever got a pair of new boots or new sneakers and they, they, they're killing your feet because they're not soft yet, I use the heavies to break in my boots at work, and then I go back to the regular ones. Now the biggest thing I think, and I keep saying the biggest thing is it's such an awesome company, right? Is that they have a 100% full-on warranty, lifetime warranty. Lifetime warranty, so think about that. You know, a merino wool sock may be a little bit more expensive when you first purchase it, Right. but when you're talking about a lifetime product, yeah. all right, versus a buying a yeah. pack of cheap socks yeah. that'll be gone. Yeah, you go to Walmart and you buy some cheap socks, and then what, a couple months later, you gotta buy some more cheap socks, well, and yeah, then you just that's keep right. going through it. Well, so what's the, other the price thing, point if we're Well, at, if so we're a here? typical sock like we've been looking at here, is retails somewhere between twenty and twenty-four dollars, depending right. on the height of it and the thickness right. of it. All right, okay. all of them are about seventy percent merino wool. Okay. The rest of it is nylon that gives it its structure and some of its durability. Okay, so and that's what the next thing that we should get into here: structure of the, the sock. structure of the sock. What you're going to find is one of their standard socks. You're going to see these ridge lines that they stitch into it, and what this does is it holds the it holds the sock into your foot. So it, it actually helps with the wearing of the sock and actually helps with keeping all the blood in your circulation, just like you, see, you know your old grandfather wearing his socks up to his knees. You know, it's the same kind of technology, except it's, it's you know, it's more, more advanced. They put the thick wool where it needs to be, where you're gonna wear on your heel. If anybody works in work boots and steel-toed boots, you'd see that the first part that's gonna wear is gonna be here, and then in this area here where your foot's always rubbing. Um, I wear these socks 16 hours a day, and I, uh, I, I climb up and down ladders. I can't tell you how many stairs I climb in a given day. Um, 
I've, I, I still have the same six pairs of socks I bought from 10 years ago. That's how good these socks are. Yeah. So. Yeah, uh, is, is Jesse is uh, he's not a paid spokesman. You know, right? Jesse. Jesse is, I just, just met. <laughs> I just met Jesse yesterday. But I got to tell you something that w what was really astounding to me is this is our second year at this show. Mm. The number of people we gave socks to last year who mm. came back here, and we said to them, "These are the best socks you're ever going to wear in your mm. life." And of course, you know, people are going to be a little Whatever. skeptical. Yeah, yeah. Right. Right. <laughs> right. All of them came back here and said, "You know what? You're right." Yeah. And I bought five more pair or whatever. Yeah. I wear them every day. I yeah. mean, and then some yeah. people like Jesse have brought other people along. Jesse's brought a lot yeah. of people over. But that's I've, what I've, I've I like got, about I've him. He likes to one share. one free pair of socks from Point Six, my first pair, and every other pair I've bought for myself. And, you know, before we, we get into anything else, you know, your mom and dad tell you that it's the most important thing is to buy socks and underwear. And when you get... In Christmas time, you get you get that package and you get a pair of socks. How excited are you, right? You know <laughs> no, what? If you don't have point not. six socks, you don't have cool socks. All right. And the only other thing I can tell you is in the underwear department, they're about to launch un, uh, an undergarment. And if you've ever worn merino wool undergarments, they're they're unbelievable. This, so is, a, this is a little bit of a scoop. By the way, yeah, well, oh, because we have we have we haven't info really... you weren't supposed to give out, man. Well, well, <laughs> We're not sure whether it's secret or not, but we had not intended to go into base layers, what we mm -hmm. call it, uh, for several years. But several of our very, very large customers, retail customers, mm -hmm. said, we will get rid of the number one seller if you guys bring your wool to our market. So okay. we sort of backed into it. All right. Okay. So now we're cool. doing it. All right. And yeah. of course, that'll become an important part of our market. Right. Absolutely. So what do we, let's show some stuff here. Let's get into the booth a little bit. Sure. And, and uh, you know, show us what you have going on here in the booth. Good. Well, so what you're seeing is socks of um, different, different, heights different height, different thicknesses. And in some cases, they will have added padding underneath the foot. Okay. okay? Do you do, the, oh, you do do the little ankle thing. And you do a lower socks, yeah. Okay. And, and you know, the, what you're seeing here is a line that, that we developed for our tactical customers, mostly military okay. initially. Uh, but, you know, we're, we're very well known for making hiking, running, right. skiing socks. And, okay, and cool. as Jesse said, each one of those is specifically engineered for that for sport. For that purpose. Yeah. And, right. and okay. we'll, most of us in the, in the company are, well, we're all athletes. And so each one of us brings our own, and, but we test this on lots of folks. Okay, okay. so two questions I have yeah. before we wrap up here. One, what is it that we haven't covered that you definitely want our audience out there to know about? You know what, I could talk forever about the nuances of high construction. And even, we, we use a special uh, yarn construction uh, that's different from everybody else. It's called compact spun yarn, but that's a technical thing. The real difference, frankly, as Jesse will attest, you wear them and you find out. All right? Okay, you wear it and you find out. And and then um, my next question on that would be, how do people get their hands on this? They go to Big Daddy Guns. <laughs> yeah, we're going to be carrying them in the <clears throat> store, by the way, for everyone that's in the Gainesville area. But if they're not, they're, if they're not in Gainesville, well, they're, we, we're they're in they retail do? stores all over the country, mostly in our outdoor sports, but we're also online you know, okay. at point6.com. Okay, so you it's can go right to the store. Great order. place to check us out and see awesome. what we're all about. Awesome, yeah. cool. So here's what I'm going to do. I am going to get into this and find out and let you guys know because I would love to find some socks that I don't have to constantly throw out and get new ones. So I want to thank you guys for this. Thanks, Jesse. Yeah, man. No problem. You know, yeah, for, for you. Uh, opening yeah, this door yeah, for me. Yeah. And uh, you know what? We will do some more stuff on this. We'll have Jesse. Maybe we'll have Skip come on the podcast. You know or what we like should that. do is you should interview yourself after you've worn these socks. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> that would be that would be cool. Yeah, I'm sure we'll do that. Okay, guys. So thanks for joining us. This is 2018 Shot Show coverage live on the convention floor, and we're at the Point Six booth.